that 14 game skid. Now, on the first play, Fields gets leveled. That's been an issue at times this year. So, line is now allowed 21 sacks, third most in the National Football League. This time, Fields will keep it. And he's going to get that yardage back and then some. Just getting the snap off a design run. Justin Fields able to pick up the first. He and then that guy, number 25, Darrington Evans, just signed off of Miami's practice squad this week. And he's going to get the ball here, Evans, but quickly swallowed up in the backfield. He likes it, but he loves the way that they change up that defense. Low snap here, Fields under duress. And there is more pressure from Brian Flores' defense. Big man can move, though. Don't let that click for you. So the Vikings set up with a first and five. Cousins on play action and a good pitch and catch across midfield. A third down and seven. Cousins in and out of the hands of Brandon Powell. He wanted a flag on Jamin Johnson, who just returned this week from the hamstring injury. Kick on the way, and it is good. Joseph remains perfect on the season. Surprised you're not going with the pressure look here from Foles. They just bring four. And Fields able to get the first down. DJ Moore. Also see Brian Flores went with more of the zone there rather than bringing pressure. This is Bayless Jones, the wide receiver, getting the carry. This isn't a good sign with so few backs available. Ninth play of the drive. Well, here's Darrington and Evans. Sneaking inside the 15 here and backing his way. Look at the push. Oh, my. What a run with a little help from his friends for Darrington Evans. Now on a third and goal. Fields steps up, takes off, and he's hit and dropped. Harrison Phillips the first to get there. No gain. And Santos remains perfect this year. Yet to miss a kick. We are all even. Off the play action. Cousins over the middle, and he's able to find Osborne. And now on a third and five, here comes pressure. Cousins able to get the first down. It's Osborne again. Down to the 35-yard line for a pickup of 12. Right, it's gonna... oh. Cousins with work to do here. They dump it over the middle to Powell. But Powell is dropped quickly. This one will go inside the upright. And kickers have all the points so far. Oh, no. Surprise them with a pass play. Well, they'll keep it on the ground. Evans fumbled it. But the Bears able to recover. So Fields out of the gun, needing 16 yards. And he'll step up and take off. He's not going to get there, though. Rookie first-round pick, the fourth receiver taken in the draft. Here they go back to the veteran, though, K.J. Osborne. Just sits and watches here as his offense goes back to work with a first and ten. Cousins under pressure just flips it. That's a line ball. And jumping on it is TJ Edwards. You saw TJ Hawkinson come in motion. You would think that one of those guys, and this happened a week ago as well on a similar type on averages. After discussion, it is in fact a backward pass, which was not recovered in bounds by mm. Chicago. Therefore, it is still Minnesota's ball, second down. Fields sets up shot to throw it. Over the middle, nice catch. Perfectly placed ball. Boy, Darnell Moody almost stayed on his feet. Right now, this Vikings defense holding D.J. Moore to just one catch for seven yards. Up the middle, Darrens and Evans, and he'll get to the 35. 53-yarder, clear long for Santos is 55. This one is right down the gut, no problem. Vikings one for five on third down this afternoon. 
Cousins. Ball flips in the air. And it's intercepted. There's a fight for it right now around the 33 yard line, but the signal on the field is that it was intercepted. Fields again from the gun. That one is lofted in the air. It's intercepted. It is picked up by Jordan Hicks. Boy, Fields got his throw disrupted. The duck went into the air and into the hands of the ninth-year linebacker. He's really feeling it back there. He's pumped. Second and four. There's a completion to Powell. A flag comes in at the end of this play following the first down pickup. Because it's nine for 14 so far, under 100 yards. Trying to go over that mark here as he connects with his tight end, TJ Hawkinson. On third downs in every game. Cousins looking for the first down. He's got it. His tight end, TJ Hawkinson. Either your receiver gets it or nobody gets it. Cousins perfect on this drive so far. Looking in so caught. Touchdown. It's the rookie, Jordan Addison. And Minnesota grabs the lead late in the second quarter. Kirk said, let me see every pass in the guy's car. PAT blocked. And Tyreek Stevenson got his hand on that. His athleticism, again, I think you need to take advantage of that. Not sure if that he went the wrong way on that, but look at the way he can escape. Well, here's the athleticism, the escapability, and he steps out near midfield with a first down. Needs seven yards. He's got time, and now the pressure gets to him. He tried to flip it last second, but I think they're going to say he's down. Daniil Hunter on the field is that the quarterback was down prior to the pass. Look, I know Josh Patalos is coming down from the safety spot. We're back there at safety. But sometimes you have to take a chance. What a beautiful punt that time from Gill. Cousins from the back of the end zone. Underneath Hawkinson. And the Bears defense able to get to him quickly, so. Pressure coming here. And the ball is out. It's still free, and the Vikings pick it up. Down the sideline goes Jordan Hicks, and Hicks is in for the scoop and score for the Minnesota Vikings. So the rookie, Tyson Bajan. Now Bajan quickly out to the left to Moody. Moody able to get the sideline before he's chucked out of bounds. Low snap, and Bajan throws it incomplete. That was a forward pass out to Mooney. They need to get to the 42. And that pass is caught, but was he in bounds? No. Cousins with pressure coming, gets it to Addison. Well, Addison makes it a much more manageable field goal try. Like it's leaking right, and it does. Look at all those bodies near the line of scrimmage. Second down and six. Bajan will try to throw it. And he's able to get the first down. There is DJ Moore right on cue. He just plays, and it's that run after the catch that makes him so dangerous. This time, Bajan looking for him again. Can he hold on to that? My goodness, he did. So far, six for nine in his NFL debut. Now seven for ten. First down, first and goal for Chicago. You have to be able to replace with another guy to cover. Trying to bounce it outside, straight ahead. And stopped about a yard short. Ninth play of the drive with inside of eight minutes left. Bajan on a sneak. No signal. They uncover the bodies, and they say touchdown! Tyson Bajan, first touchdown for the rookie. And we've got a one-score game. Just try something underneath, don't get crazy. 
Cousins from right around his five yard line goes underneath to Madison. He needs to get to the 35. He will not get there. Major escapes off his back foot. Coming back to grab it. Tyler Scott, and he does haul it in. It's five yards, so second and five. Back to the ground. Up the middle and another first down and in the Viking territory. Across midfield to the 49. What a play. This is four down territory. Third down and three. And a first down conversion. Bajan calm in the pocket. And Bajan able to take advantage. Coming up on the two minute warning. Bajan lets it fly, but it's a duck and it's intercepted. Byron Murphy picked it off. Oh, then he fumbles it. And they're fighting for it right around the 45 yard line. But it is going to be Minnesota's football. The really on the field is an interception, a fumble, and recovery by Minnesota. Go to them and say the same thing, but now they see the results. Players start to buy in a little bit more. And they'll try to milk the clock. This is a big first down pickup for Alexander Madison. Cousins goes back, waits for the clock to hit zeros, takes a knee, and the Vikings hang on and win it here in Chicago 19-13.